ESPN. This is Christian United Broadcasting Network. We're located at www.cubnlive.com. All right, what's next on our news? Well, okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to talk about Japanese mobster bows to Christ. Pastor's church of ex-drug criminals. Think about that for a second. Think about it. This is a guy that's a mobster. Takes in ex-criminals. Pastors to him. How low can you go in your life before you find the Lord? Now doing what he did and being who he is, something inside of him led him to do what I'm about to read. Something inside of him led him to do that. Besides all the mobsters and probably the killings and drugs. What led him to do what he did? Only he knows that. That's why he's sharing. Only he knows that. Only he knows that. They call him teacher. The gangster turned pastor joined the Japanese mafia when he was 17. CNN reports. But now baptized hundreds in the name of Jesus. Wow. I know how bad I was and the bad things I had done, says Tatsua Shindu. At the same time, I know how much I was forgiven by God. So I wanted to engage myself in God's work. Shindu pastors a congregation of about 100 in an old bar. Former loan sharks, drug dealers, and more who are fam familiar with a life of crime comprise the par parishioners. Before we were in revival, before we were in Rival gangs, firing guns, Shindu said. Now, we're praising the same God. Prison bars held Shindu captive when they finally found the Lord. It was the gangster's seventh time in jail. Ezekiel 33, 11. Captured the heart of the meth at meth addicted inmate who once ran who once ran in one of the most prestigious circles of the yakuza of japanese mafia say to them as i live says the lord god i have no pleasure in the death of the wicked but rather that the wicked Turn from his way and live, the passage reads. Turn, turn from your evil ways, for why will you die, O house of Israel? And turn he did, the pastor sheathed it in tattoos and missing a finger has baptized more than 100 people, including his mother. They are seeking divine intervention, says Shindu. They want God to help them with their problems. A lot of people that cross these people actually think that they should die. Actually think that they should be terminated death penalty because all the bad things they did but who are we to judge other people we all do things in our lives that is messed up that is evil but in his situation he did things that who knows how bad it was 
It was so bad to the point where God just said, enough is enough. You know, enough is enough. And he took charge, did what he did. That man was led to do what he did.